Hello friends, uh, in this video, I am going to explain what is HCF and how to find the HCF of given numbers. So HCF stands for highest common factor. So the highest common factor of two or more numbers is the greatest number which divides each of them exactly. For example, Find the HCF of 24 and 56. Okay, so highest common factor. So we have to find the factors of 24 and 56, right? So the factors of 24 are 1, 2, 3, 4, 6. 8, 12 and 24 itself. 1 divides 21 is a factor of 24, 2 is also 3, 4, 6, 8, 12, 24. So these are all the factors of 24. Now the factors of 56 are 1, 2, uh, 4 and 7, 8, 14, 28 and 56 itself okay now common factor right so we have to find the common factors common factors of 24 and 56 is equal to 1 2 4 8 Thus, HCF stands for highest common factor. So, the highest in the common factors are 8. So, the HCF of 24 and 56 are 8. Sorry, is. HCF of 24 and 56 is 8. Right? So, the HCF is the highest common factor of two or more numbers which exactly divides the each number. So there are two methods are there to find the HCF of given number. So one is factors method, another one is the division method. So now let's find the HCF of 48, 108 and 140 using factors method, right? So the factors of 48 is equal to, so 2 into 24, so 2 into 2 into 12, equal to 2 into 2 into 2 into 6 and that is going to be this can also I can write is 2 into 3 so that is going to be 2 to the power of 4 into 3 the same factors of 108 we will get 2 square into 3 cube okay and then the factors of 140 we will get 2 square into 5 into 7 ok so the factors of 48 are 2 to the power of 4 and into 3 and the factors of 108 is 2 to the power of 4 2 into 3 cube and the factors of 140 are 2 to the square into 5 ok so now the common factor here the common factor is only 2 for all these three numbers. The common factor is 2 here, 2 here and 2 here. 3 is only common factor to the two numbers that is 48 and 108. So 140 is not containing 3 as a factor. So we ignore 3. 5 we ignore 5 also because it is the factor to 140. And we ignore 7 also it is a factor. So now 2 to the power of 4, 2 square and 2 square. So the common is 2 square in all this. We have here 2 to the power of 4. We do not take that one, but we 
because it contains two square also plus and two square here also two square here also so that's why we consider the hcf of 48 108 and 148 simply two square so that is four so this is the factorization method okay so now we will see the division method so division method So now let's find the HCF of 777 and 1147 using division method. So in division method, what we will do is actually we divide the bigger number using the smaller number. So 1147 and then we divide this one using triple seven so triple seven one ja seven 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 uh, when we subtract we get three seventy and next we next number that is the so the divisor will become okay so dividend here so that one is triple seven okay so this number will come here okay now again we divide this one three seventy two two ja 740 and we get uh, 37 as a reminder so again 370 will move here so 370 so into 10 and then we get 370 so reminder 0 so we repeat this processor until we get the reminder 0 so the last divisor divisor will become the hcf of this number see 777 here dividing here so here we are dividing 7, 377 by remainder. Again, this 370 is divided by the remainder here. So 377 moved here and then 370 is moved here. So this is the process. So we have to repeat this processor until we get the remainder 0. So the last divisor will become the HCF. So the HCF of 777, 1147 is 37 so this is the division method so i hope you understand this thank you very much for watching this video please subscribe to my channel